Hey, what's up, everybody? Gamers, non-gamers alike. They're going to do something a little bit different. This is fanatical.com. They had a sale on keys. They're a bit like Humble Bundle. I don't know the authenticity of this website. It says 100% official keys only. So, I mean, then there's the Trustpilot logo. So we, I, I trust it. That's as far as my involvement in this goes. Um, the Easter Extravaganda Mystery Bundle. $6.99 for 10 keys. If you scratch off and get a golden egg, you could win 100 games. But either way, 10 random games. Traffic. 10, 10 random games. I'm going to scratch these off, and I'm not going to redeem any of them. You can redeem them. You get to keep whatever you can race to uh, uh, input into your Steam library. Um, unless I explicitly say that, uh, yeah, no, we, we wanted to keep this one. Wife behind me clearing her throat. Okay. What's the mystery coupon? Well, it's a bonus voucher minus 5%, and there's the code for that, but you know, I, I, don't, I don't care about that. I don't care about that. So literally, literally, if you're watching this, I'm going to be scratching these off, and unless I explicitly state that I'm going to be keeping any of these, you can have them. I'm not going to paste these keys anywhere. You're going to have to pause the video and put these keys into your Steam uh, library yourself. But here we go with Tier 1. We're going to reveal the key. And uh, if I like this, and you guys like this, I might make this a recurring thing whenever there are bundles going on on Fanatical. And we got Candle. It's just called Candle. It's a Steam game called Candle. It's not even giving me a picture, a title screen or anything. Is that normal? I can't really look for Candle on Google. Steam game. What a waste of time. Give me your thumbnail, a link, whatever. All right, this is Candle. This is what we just unlocked. It's an adventure game. Looks like it's going to have puzzles, challenging, very weird art style. This is a boy who looks like he's got a turkey, a cooked turkey for a body and a bag on his head. There's potato elements in the design. This is what could be yours. And no, I'm not going to be answering comments on, on whether or not anything's been redeemed or not redeemed or if there's anything left, anything like that. I don't have time to be checking on that constantly. Uh, but, you know, I don't have that many, that many folks watching. So, I mean, your chances of getting a key are as good as any, even if the video's a week old. Next key. There's 10 of these. Panarium. God, another. i got to do this for every one. Why? Panarium. Panarium has a demo. This is a $10 game. Pixel graphics? Yes. Made by Self Made Miracle? Uh huh. Uh huh. Looks like platforming? Action? I like it. <clears throat> I'm not going to keep it though. You can have it. It is all yours. If you redeem any of these, I'd love to know down in the comments below. Actually, that might save other people some time. If you race to redeem this key right here, pause the video if you want to see the key. Tier number three, Leaves the Journey. Leaves the Journey. <clears throat> this is fun because it's like scratching off lottery tickets. This is an $8 game on Steam by Daedalic Entertainment. Well, published by them. It was developed by Czar21. We're not going to watch the videos. This has very nice, lovely graphics. Looks very alien, very unique art style. Look at these little cartoon men. They could be poops. Don't want to speculate on what that thing is. This could be yours for the price of nothing. For the price of... Whoops. Reopen that. For the price of stopping the video and copying this key here. All right, next game, Tier 4. Sir, you are being hunted. Interesting. It's this one. It is a $5 game on Steam. Oh, God. Stealth and Survival for Sir or Madam. Interesting. First-person shooter. Looks like you've got visibility, health, vitality, rounds, ammo, your current item. Are those, like, Steampunk Terminators? This one looks pretty cool. Wow. Yeah. 
Victorian London with monsters and steam-powered stuff. Here's the key for that. I'm not going to redeem that either. It's all yours. Crowd. Fans. Fam. Next is Blasphemous. <sighs> Sorry, guys. Blasphemous is mine. Blasphemous, twenty-five dollars. This is the this is the this is the clear winner for this bundle. Yeah, I'm, I don't even want to show you because you you don't get to have this one. <laughs> it's mine, mine, oh mine. I've been waiting for Blasphemous for a long time. Amazing. Well. That's my pick. I'm not going to keep any of the other games in this. Wife might really, really want one. But we'll see. Tier 6. King of Dragon Pass. King of Dragon Pass. King of Dragon Balls. This is a $12 game on Steam by A Sharp LLC. Published by HeroCraft PC. Ah... It's a text-based game. How nice. Look at that. I love that. You don't get any more screenshots than that. $12. Could be yours. Here's the key. Tier 7, Streets of Fury EX. This is going to be a Streets of Rage clone. I don't even need to... This, don't even need to know. By Guard Crush. No, it's not. It's a oh, it's a tournament fighter with really weird like anti aliased mocap sprites. So it's like Mortal Kombat. Oh, that's weird, y'all. There's the maybe it is like Streets of Yeah, I don't know. No, oh, okay, there's four players. There's up to four players. Never mind, it is like, this looks like purely side-scrolling. This is the most bizarre Streets of Rage clone I've ever seen. Good job, I guess, Guard Crush. That's $10. It can be yours. It's right here. Herky Ziff P3 Yasilo. Just redeem that key. Tier 8 is Zanzara the Hidden Portal. Why did I do that again? Zanzara the Hidden Portal. Eight dollars. Oven's going off. This one, uh, I don't know what to think about this yet. None of the screenshots are coherent. Is it an adventure game? It looks really neat. It looks really, really nice. I think Shar is going to take this one. <clears throat> That's it's really cool. Hard to try to figure out. Shara's going to take this one, guys. She just gave me a thumbs up. That's it. These last two are all yours, no matter what they are. I don't care if it's Kakarot Origins, Black Guards 2. Oh, my God. I've gotten this in literally every, I feel like, every one that I've opened. It's $15. I already know this is not my kind of game. About 50 hype videos for it here. And then it's, uh, come on, full full size, please. There we go. Beautiful. Yeah, I say not my kind of game. I don't know. Just judging from screenshots, it looks like something that might be a bit more involved than what I want to try to tackle at this time. It looks really cool, though. Looks like it's very strategic. And, uh, what's the word? Kind of like SOCOM. Or XCOM, I mean. SOCOM. Tier 10, Mystery Egg Game, and it is The Last Federation. I don't know. Oh, you won't let me copy. You st Stop it. Okay. It's The Last Federation. The Last Federation can be yours for $19.99. It's by Arson Games, LLC. It has a mostly positive rating on Steam. Interesting. Looks like campaign-based storytelling. Lots of different little game modes. What have we got? Race relations? That's cool. So it's very political. It is, just like I thought, it's very inspired by Star Trek. That's my 20 second now uh, observation of this game. So that's it. All right.
Cool. And the rest of these, I, I guess I could start checking these off, <laughs> revealing the keys and whoever gets them gets them. I'll do that another time. I'll do that another time. What did you think? Did you like this? Do you want to see more? Do you like when I spend money and just give you crap? All right. Uh, subscribe. Uh, uh, notify the bell of punching. Smack the like icon. Resub Reddit. Retweet. Re. Uh, is MySpace still a thing? MySpace this video. Okay. Bye. See you next video.